As the illegal fireworks start ringing out around Albuquerque over the weekend and the 4th of July, the calls won't be flooding into the city's fireworks hotline. That's because the city is doing away with the hotline this year. News 13's Madeline Schmidt is live downtown at AFD's fire marshal's office with the reason why. Madeline? Yeah, well, Jessica, every 4th of July for the last several years, you could call in people setting off fireworks they're not supposed to be. But starting Saturday and running through the 5th, you will not be able to reach a live human to make a report. Rule of thumb, if you have to look up at it, you shouldn't be shooting it off in the city of Albuquerque. Not go any higher than 10 feet in the air or no wider than 6 feet. In diameter. In years past, fireworks hotline may I help you. People could call in to a room of volunteers and report mortar shells. This year, that won't be the case. The city is now relying entirely on people either reporting via the 311 app or submitting a report online at fireworks.cabq.gov. Comes in quicker, it's easier to review and get us dispatched out to them. Really? Better than the hotline? Yes. But some firefighters have expressed concern to News 13 over the loss of the hotline. They worry people will resort to calling 911, clogging up the lines and busying first responders when they need to be available for life or death emergencies. That's something Fire Chief David Downey even talked about two years ago while advocating the hotline. Before we used to have the hotline, I mean, the, the, the 400 calls a night would go to 911. So not only does it um, tie up the 911 operators for the real emergencies, we don't get the dispatches to the real emergencies out as quickly. Today, AFD said there is a concern about that, but the fire marshal's office team hopes this kind of exposure will curb that. Please do not call 911 for illegal fireworks. Mm -hmm. Someone's sick, heart attacks, car accident, fires. Uh, those are the things that we need the 911 available for. Now, last year, there were 2,300 reports of illegal fireworks that came into the city of Albuquerque over the 4th of July holiday weekend. We are told that half of those came in through the 311 app. The other half, about 1,000 plus calls, those came in through phone calls. Back to you. All right, thank you, Madeline. We asked how many people in a city of roughly 600,000 have the 311 app on their smartphones or tablets. The answer is 14,000 downloads since it was launched.